All right, so we got some horrible, horrible news. And to be honest with you, man, I hate seeing, you know, games go down this road because, um, I mean, I don't wish, you know, failure on, you know, on, on no game or on no console, whatever. So today we got, um, now I've actually reacted to this game. It's called Concord. I reacted to like the, uh, I think I reacted to like two of the trailers on my channel. You guys know, like, bro, I always try to cover like, you know, all like the new trailers, um and you know like the new gameplays and stuff like that you know i'm always trying to like you know be on that and stuff like that so um yeah concord the game that i was actually pretty excited about um has been they're actually shutting down i think the last day um of concord of like the concord game is on the 6th which is on friday which is in like two more days so it is it's crazy because you know you never want to see this and but to be honest with you like this happens a lot this happens a lot. I, I don't know if, if you guys know, but like a lot of games in the gaming industry, um, they really tend to, I'm, bro, some don't even make it. That, that's just the, that's just the, j j just pure of it. Some, like some games don't make it. I don't know if you guys don't know that or whatever. So if you guys are like, you know, future game developers out there, I don't want to like, you know, put fear in your heart or whatever. But all I'm, like, all I'm saying is that, um, that in reality of everything like that, bro, a lot of these games that you think are, that are going to do well or a lot of these games, you know, they don't really end up doing too well. Not because, you know, you know, like the actual gameplay is not good or whatever. It's just because a lot of people are not, you know, it's because a lot of people aren't really, you know, com like contributing, you know, to the game. And to be honest with you, it's, it's not like it's their fault. You know, like, there's only so many games, you know, we can all play in, like, a, in like the 24 hours or whatever. But uh, to be honest with you, um, it, it is sad, you know, to, just to see a game that I was literally like, going to try out to play. Uh, it's sad that, you know, that we're going to see a game uh, go out like this. So, a little bit more information on, like, you know, what happened and, and how this stuff like that. Bro, I already got this news today, which is crazy. But uh, a little bit more information about the game, about... You know why you know Sony took it down, and yeah, and it was actually Sony who took it down. Um, now I believe Concord is made by uh, f was it Firewalk? Uh, no, it's Firewalk Studios. Um, shout out to them. Uh, they actually you know developed you know uh, Concord, and and I think Sony, I think Sony themselves took it down. Now the reason I think they took it down was because um, I think there was like a certain like threshold that they it, remember. Uh, Concord was a live service game. That means it was like a it was like a multiplayer game. It was a five v five multiplayer game, and um, the gameplay looked nice. I've said this before. Whenever I reacted to like the actual trailer and stuff like that, the the gameplay looked nice. The the uh, the, the, um, the animations looked nice as well. Um, I just haven't got time to like you know get to the game because you know obviously like you know I'm a I'm a content creator, so you know I'm always putting my time into YouTube and I got other stuff going on. So. At the end of the day, like, I couldn't even, like, you know, bro, I barely got time to game in a day. Like, bro, like, I'm, I'm even lucky, like, I, I mean, I do feel good, like, whenever I game. Like, I try to game, like, one, like, at least for, like, a little bit every single day, you know, because, um, I mean, obviously, bro, I love gaming, and gaming is, like, my whole, it's, it's my YouTube channel, so I love gaming. But um, I get so busy whenever it comes to YouTube that uh, sometimes that I barely get to game. I'd be, I'd be too tired at the end of the day. Um, but I, I, I kind of, like, know how to manage that now, but. I was literally trying to like you know trying to get to Concord like I I'm, 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 I'm listen I'm gonna be honest with you I'm not gonna say I was trying to get to the game like you know tomorrow or like the next day or whatever but whenever I'm free I was like you know tr gonna try like check it out because like why not um, but yeah it turns out um, I'm guessing the reason Sony pulled it from the shelves or like you know took it took it off uh, was because it I mean it, it was it was poor sales basically a lot of a lot of people weren't really interested in it I think the game had if I'm if I'm wrong, correct me please. But I think the game had about had around twenty five thousand players, and that was really it. Now to be fair, to be fair, right? Now twenty five thousand players for a game is not bad at all. Don't ever, don't even, you know. Listen, if anybody's from Concord, if you guys ever like watch this, whatever. I mean, you know, cause bro, I don't even know who watches my videos nowadays, bro. Sometimes it's like some voice actors watch it, some game developers watch my videos. Sometimes you guys watch my videos. First of all, shout out to you for watching my videos. But um, you know, don't ever get discouraged. You know, twenty five thousand people looked at your game and was like, you know what, I'm, I'm gonna give it a try. Um, so if you are a small, you know, gaming development company, uh, not company, but if you're like a small, um, inspiring gaming, uh, developer, brother, if you get 25,000 people to play a game, brother, you're good. 
I'm not saying that you can't aim for more, you know, because like you know, you, I mean, that's all, that's depending on like your mindset, or whatever. But twenty five thousand people is a lot of people, you know, especially for your game. But for this game right here, man, um, for this game, they were, and when I say they, I mean probably, I, I think probably Firewalks and um, Sony were projecting this game to like do really, really, really big numbers. Um, I heard that this game took about eight years to make which is a bummer because imagine working on something for eight years working on this one thing for eight years and now is the time for you to release this thing out into the world to see how it does and and for you to fall short of your goals or whatever people still played it but you didn't hit the you didn't hit the numbers that you thought you were going to hit you get what i'm saying so um yeah, I think you got about, I think you got around twenty five thousand players, um, you know, to play the game, and I don't know what they were aiming for, but obviously, you know, they're taking it off the they're taking it off the shelf. So I don't think they were even nowhere near because if they were if they were near their goal, they'll still keep it up. They'll still keep it up. They're, they might they they might try to you know, um, get IGN or GameSpot to like drop like a few gameplays. They might try to you know um, sponsor some streams on Twitch and YouTube. Or like sponsors like some streamers on you know Twitch and YouTube and kick and stuff like that to like you know to play the game to you know to to get more eyes on it uh, if they were really close just by themselves but you know and, and only sold twenty five thousand I don't know what their goal was um, but you know they they took it off so um, I do feel bad for Fireworks Studios you know look I didn't even know this game took eight years to make I looked it up and I was like okay how long did it take you know how long did Fire Fireworks um, you know, like how long was the de uh, development, you know, for this game, bro? That thing said eight years, bro. That I can't lie to you, bro. That I, I bro, that I felt bad right there, bro. Because imagine working eight years for something, bro, and then the day that you drop, like, the, like not even the day, but like the area that you drop it in, you drop it, boom, and then it, you know, it underperforms, you know. And again, to be honest with you, I feel absolutely horrible. Um, but also, here's the thing, though. You have to understand, right? And to be honest with you, the concept of the game was a 5v5 multiplayer. It was a live service game. I think a lot of people, and, and I'm not going at at, at uh, fireworks for this. Uh, sorry, not, sorry, not fireworks. Uh, firewalks. I'm not going at them for this. But, like, bro, there's, a, there's already a lot of live, um, like, live... Um, there's already like there's already like a lot like there's like a lot of like live what was it like like live gaming like um like games out there I, 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 my brain is fried I mean I'm sorry y'all but there's already like a lot of games like that there's already like a lot there's already like a lot of like you know multiplayer live games out there and to be honest with you I just think that like because when did it drop it also depends on like when you drop your game because if you have a game and like you work on it for a very long time and you just drop it in like a and you drop it in like a really tight space around other big games that could lower you know your sales too you know so you know for instance let's say um let's say i have a game right and i drop it i don't know um october of 2024 to be honest with you bro my game most likely isn't going to get any sales because guess what you have until dawn coming out now i'm not saying that people can't play multiple games but listen to this. L listen to what I'm about to say. Let's say I drop my game in October of 2024. That's literally next month. If I drop my game next month, guess what's coming out next month? Dragon Ball, Budokai Chi, uh, Black Ops 6, Until Dawn, Silent Hill 2. Um, 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 what else, bro? There's a. I think there's. Oh no no. Is that Mario? No no. no Mario game is dropping in November. Um, what else is dropping in 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 October, Dude, bro? That's like those four games that I just named, bro. Those are like those are like big games that a lot of people are like, you know, they're gonna be playing that. And to be honest with you, bro, I do feel bad because like, yes, it's all about timing. Yes, it's all about you know when you drop your game, month wise or whatever. But you know, again, to be fair, you know, you gotta, you also gotta look at the market and and like look at what they're doing because obviously like. If you've been working on the game for a long time, you can't just scrap the game and just be like, oh, okay, well, you know what? Everybody everybody right now likes Battle Royale. That's just an example. But every right now, everybody right now likes, you know, Battle Royale. So guess what? I'm going to just scrap this and make like a Battle Royale thing. 
No, you can't really do that because they obviously like, you know, you wasted a lot of money on this, whatever, da, 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 right? And again, to be honest with you, like a lot of games nowadays, like we already have like a lot of uh, live multiplayer games already. Like, like this, like the market and like, 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 bro, legit, the market in that column is heavy, bro. It's heavy. We already have a lot of games that, you know, that uh, depend on like the live service or whatever. So at the end of the day, you know, and am I not saying that Concord is not going to do good in the live service? Yeah, but then like you have games like Fortnite, you have games like um, Overwatch. I mean, bro, and guess what? Overwatch is still kicking, even though a lot of people don't like the game or whatever, bro. Overwatch is still, you know, they're still kicking, you know, that, that's still going, even though like, you know, 100 and like, even though I got like 150,000, you know, negative reviews or whatever. It's still going at the end of the day. So, you know, you just got nothing to do but respect it, you know. Um, and those are like a few examples. Like, you know, at the end of the day, you know, you can't really. I mean, you can, but like at the end of the day, you can't really fault people for not playing your game. There's so many games like yours. Now, am I saying that Concord is like copied off or whatever? No, I'm not saying that. But at the end of the day, you have to look at your competition as well, you know. And and, and at it like. I do feel bad, but I mean, I don't know, bro. Maybe they should have dropped their game earlier, or I don't know if they were like forced to drop their game. But I think dropping the game, when did they drop it? Hold on, give me one second. I'm gonna look it up because if they drop their game now, dropping your game now is not a bad thing, especially in like September. That's not a bad thing. I just think that a lot more people are either focusing on other games because like it is september bro warhammer bro oh my god black myth will come people are buying that game people are buying uh the star wars game um like the star wars outlaws game um we have the casting of frank stone um and bro like i said black myth will come like a lot of people are still buying that game you know so all right let me see uh when did concord come out and also like let's not even and if you really want to get like deep down to it or whatever Oh, wait, so it dropped last month. It dropped uh, August 23rd. August 23rd, 2024. Oh, no. Okay, because Black Myth Wukong ends... Uh, Black Myth Wukong dropped on a 30... On a 30... On a 30th. No, 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 no. No, oh, my God. Black Myth Wukong dropped on the 20th. Is Concord... A, it, I know it's a live service game, but, like, it... Let me see. Is it free? Give me one second, y'all. Sorry about that. It's a live service game, so like. Oh, it was forty dollars. Oh, the way we wait, 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 wait. The game was. Oh no! Hold up. It said to be, which means you need a. Oh wait, it was a PS Plus game. Oh no, it was forty dollars. Oh no. Wait, so the game was forty dollars? Listen, I'm gonna be honest with you, and I'm not here to hate on nothing like that, but if this game came out August twenty third and Black Myth Wukong came out the twentieth of August, let's be real. A lot bro, a lot more people are gonna buy a Black Myth Wukong over Concord any day. Now I'm not roasting the game or whatever, but I'm just saying like and again, where you drop your game matters. It does. It legit matters. Games drop every single day. But at the end of the day, bro, like if I'm like a developer or if I'm like whatever, bro, listen, we got to, bro, if I see any big game in our vicinity, bro, I got to move it because there is no shot. I got to move it because I want, I want our, I want my game to drop in a space where people will be able to like, you know, Pick my game and not like be like, oh snap! But you know, NBA 2K25 is next week, so I'm gonna hold my money. Like I, like I will legit drop my money. I will legit like drop my game, like, like a week or two before a big game, or not even a week or two, but like, bro, like, I don't know, like a like three weeks before like a big game. Like that's how careful I would be, um, because you know, and and you can tell like fireworks. I keep saying fireworks. I'm sorry about that. You can tell that fireworks. You can tell they had like a lot of passion in their game and it hurts too. And oh my god. Bro, this is gonna hurt me. And I heard that this game costs a hundred million dollars. Oh 
a hundred million dollars lord jesus i mean which makes sense because it was in development for eight years and to be honest with you like i said before looking at the looking at the actual gameplay i mean it looks pretty good i mean it, it bro that's horrible bro that's horrible i feel bad for them bro i really feel bad for them i bro i, I hate to see because like at the end of the day all right cool it could be funny oh your game flop da 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 but man, like I feel, I feel bad, bro. Because imagine, like, and the only people that will find it funny or whatever is people like who never, like, you know, made something and then you know they they showed the world, and then the world is like disinterested. If that makes sense, you know, they never did that before. Like people who really like you know took time out of their day to do something, and it underperformed, bro. I know how that feels because it's, bro, it's crazy because like. Because dropping a game is kind of like it's kind of like YouTube in a way. I know, like, and bro, all YouTubers can relate to this, bro. I like <laughs> all YouTubers can relate to this. You know why? Because like us YouTubers, bro, we we would sit and we would like you know make this really really like good video that we think is gonna go absolutely insane. You upload it and it you know it doesn't do the numbers that you wanted to do or whatever. Um, and then like you make this video that you don't even care about. Like you legit you make this video, you sit down. You make this video, you might not even edit it. You, you, you just, you just, you just do it, you know. And then you just upload it. Just, you, you just upload it. You didn't, you didn't do anything, whatever. You're like, you know what? I don't care. I'm gonna just upload it, whatever. And it does, at, bro. And it does, it does numbers that you can't even like comprehend. It's crazy. So at the end of the day, like I understand, bro. I, I bro, it's kind of like, like I wouldn't say that they're the same thing, obviously, because making a game is entirely different from, you know, you sitting down and you know entertaining people. Um, they're both like, you know, they're both, you know, I don't want to say difficult, but I mean, bro, making a video game is, is very difficult, but, um, you know, they're both different, very different. So other than that, man, um, shout out to, you know, fireworks studios. I keep saying fireworks. Oh my God. Shout out to fireworks studios. I'm so sorry, y'all. Um, hopefully, you know, you guys can like make a comeback in something, man, because, um, th working on the game for eight years and then, and then dropping it, bro. And it, it unperforming. I can't lie to you. That would be very, very, very demotivating, man. But like, I feel like I feel like they can. I feel like they can. They can make a comeback. Cause why not? You know. Yeah. Hey, listen. When you try your best, you know, and you don't succeed. I know I sound like Coldplay right now, but um, you gotta keep going, man. I, I bro, man. I know that hurts, man. I know that hurts, man. Comment down below. What do you guys think about this? Um, other than that, man. See how they're out. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel, and.